morning, everybody. I'm Miss Best to be a blessing, and this is a reading for my air signs. If you're an Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini, this reading is for you. And with that being said, I'm going to get right into your reading for September the 5th, 2022. First and foremost, I see a lot of celebrations going on. So maybe you're um, hanging out with your family and friends and things of that sort. Definitely some celebration going on. Maybe somebody's having a birthday or something. So congratulations with that. I do feel as though... Some of you have been carrying a heavy load for a very long time, and you got a lot of things that definitely weighing on your mind. Lots of decisions that need to be made is what I'm seeing. You have to use your intuition in regard to the things that you need and want. I feel like there's some healing that needs to take place. Some you can definitely be dealing with an Aquarius individual. I feel like if you've been feeling kind of off balance or something like that, things will definitely need to work out for you. It's time for you to make a head of a hard decision. You need to see things for what they really are. Whatever is a secret will be exposed, okay? I see you want somebody wants to move on to calmer waters in a sense. Tired of dealing with the bullshit is what I'm seeing. I feel like you could be dealing with a water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, that's going to come into your life to make you an offer, or you could be wanting to make an offer to somebody, okay? Somebody definitely has somebody in their emotions here, because this is the element of cups, you know, cups represents your emotions, the way that you feel about a situation. It's time to use your intuition in regard to everything. This is the high priestess card. Use your intuition in regard to everything that you need help with, okay? It's decision-making time. You're on a, um, trying to decide which path you want to go on. Um, use your intuition in regard to if somebody has betrayed you or you feel like you've been betrayed, they done done some fuck fire shit to you and you're trying to figure out what to do, that's when you use your intuition or either go to spirit so that they can help you to... Um, to do what they need to do in regard to your enemies, okay? You have the Ace of Cups here. This is an offer of love, but it also is opening up doors and wonderful opportunity for you. And like I said, several different offers will be coming in. So get ready for that. Be happy about that. But remember to choose wisely. Just because something looks good does not mean everything is good for you, all right? Mmm. Some of you, if you feel like your hands is tied or you're unsure about what decision you need to make, that's when you go back to the high priestess mode. You go back to your high priestess mode. You go back to your intuition. What should I do about this? What path should I take? Should I take this job? Should I leave this person alone? What should I do? Sit down. Get quiet. Go into hermit mode. And listen to what they have to say, and they're going to tell you what to do. I see a lot of wishes being fulfilled here, so some things you've been asking for, you're definitely going to get it. There's a partnership here that's coming up with the two of chalices. I see somebody working together with somebody hand in hand in regard to something. This is the moon card. Anything that's hidden would definitely come to the light. This represents secrets. It also it represents not just secrets all the time. It represents your intuition increasing a whole, whole lot. Some of you are going to be manifesting a lot of things. Because you're an air sign, you can speak things into being. All people can speak things into being. But you especially because that's your element, Okay. Speak what you want. Speak things into being. That's why they say be careful what you think. Be careful what you say because you just may get it. And with the sun card, you're going to be happy about the things that you're definitely going to be manifesting. And some of you have a Leo in your corner. I mean, shit, it is what it is. Going to get no better than that. All right, you guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. Have a truly, truly blessed day. Thank you, guys.